That's our cell therapy session on our <laughs> stream yard, man. Success after lockdown, you know. Right? Yeah, again, you know, we, we we this is where we delve into that mental health aspect of life and and uh just us acknowledging and understanding now what we didn't know then, you know, before. But well, now we could we could get we could find these terms, learn these terms and, and be able to share it with um people that don't have an understanding. So what's your take on this mental health, man, with the criminal well, justice? Well, for me, I didn't realize that I was caught in the matrix, um, a matrix of uh, uh, social constructed reality. I didn't realize that our realities were negotiated. We live in a world of negotiated realities. And um, when I was in prison, I didn't realize how, well, while I was in prison, I did realize how closely uh, connected we, we really are you know, almost to the juggler vein that our uh, socially constructed realities are plugged in into the matrix. And then we we energize these these things into meanings that individual could die for, right? Because we stood on these these uh, realities that we made serious. Um, once unplugging from that, everything else was clear because I no longer held to these things like umbilical cords, right? And gave them meaning. When I saw unplugged for that, I gave positive things meaning, which allowed me to move forward. Um, I had to let go a lot that I socially constructed. Like, yeah. like I what? like to say, I like to say valuable value systems and no longer distorted value systems that we we you know are uh, embedded into ourselves, living in, with this distorted value system. That yeah, exists. well. See what happens is um once you un even, even those terms that you're just speaking of value system they they're, they're still socially constructed right because everything that we do is just a form of communication and once you um make it into something that someone understand you give it meaning anyway so for me everything that I've known I had to realize it was false everything that I've known that had meaning was really no meaning at all which means if I called you my brother, you didn't have to be a uh, blood brother. You could just be individual. What I considered to have more um, value as an individual, right? Than someone who was actually closely related to me. Um, that value meant more to me than it meant to having someone else that was a blood brother, right? Or blood sister. So once I understood these meanings, that came to us through transitioning as young kids, right? Everything that we didn't know, we grew up into, to knowing, but they were false. We never questioned it, right? We never questioned the education or the homeschool training that we received. And we grew up hating the police, right? Because our parents, our older cousins and people told us to hate them because they were evil and things of that nature. But now that we see that that's just a regular job, individuals are just doing their job and the police are in our communities for X, X reasons, um, we understood that this is a very, very slippery slope that we walk, right? These things are layered. Once you really tap into them and we tap into ourselves, we begin to understand that these things were socially constructed and we have to understand the world that we live in, that it is a negotiated socially constructed reality um and that's what i come to understand that is all in my mind and that i create these things and um and if you create it you could change it absolutely 